Alright, hey guys, it's Demon coming back for another round of Final Fantasy XIV. Fortunately, we ended the previous episode, reaching the top of the highest cliff, and sitting here doing absolutely nothing. Mainly due to the fact that we have to fly still. Don't worry, hopefully, the cat will now leave me alone. He's giving, he's giving many hugs, kisses, and attention, and hopefully, at this point, she will now leave me alone for a bit. Chances are she probably won't. Hoping that was enough. Yeah, scan has begun and already it leads us to a dead end. Yeah, it's a good dead end. Yep, this note has further instructions for us. If I'm not mistaken, this same some manner of teleportation device. Actually, let me double check something. Alright, sorry about that guys. I actually want to double check that I was recording. Ah blip, you are currently within the Alpha Quadrant. First you must use the nearby matter conduit to travel to the beta quadrant. Please wait a moment while I activate it. You know what the worst thing I just imagined was? I went and did that for that cat, and my allergies are about to go ham. Oh, I'm gonna be pissed. I know for a fact my allergies are about to start acting up. Take a, a gentle nudge, and it just goes and just kills. That's their teleportation? Neat. Uh, function without man set may be described as a miracle. Oh my, wait, decline. I can. I want to reread that, but I want to talk to you guys. So I was wise to trust this orb with our lives. Oh, as well as you'll be fine. That note is what it seems. Miss the metal, I sense the gaze of a living being. I have to care around it. Now the matter of conduit appears to offer on the same principles as the etherites. How remarkable that you still function after all this time. Now say what you just said again. According to my records, this conduit was last served approximately 5,014 years, 6 months, 11 days, 7 hours, and 13 minutes ago. That is your function without may, may, mishap may be described as a miracle. Ah. Ah. Well, luckily we all have our arms and toes and legs and everything. Nobody's got their hair misplaced and we didn't all die. Resuming guidance to the Ethereum Chemical Research Facility, please follow me. Sector the Beta Quadrant is home to laboratories which produce chem uh, chimerical life forms for both military and household applications. The facility has been awarded three stars for certification for compliance with the ASO 3001. The behavior of the creatures born here is guaranteed. Please be warned, however, that a millennia of neglect may have had an adverse effect on their disposition. For your own safety, please refrain from approaching the creatures. So they were making hybrids to use in the, their military and for civilian use. Very interesting. How to fly. Oh yeah, sinuses are starting to go hell. Left nostril burning. As you can clearly hear, it's getting ready to start up. Hopefully it doesn't get too bad. Oh, it's gonna get bad, I can feel it. It's like my, my brain knows when my sinuses are about to act up. Ah, it's gonna suck. I'm telling you, my allergies for our cats just they kill ham, but I love the little furballs too much to not pet them. The area teams with chemical, chimerical creatures beyond your god. Ah, uh, the galleons do not respect life. Brilliant as they were, I cannot bring myself to respect them. I never respected it. So I'm beginning to try my patience. I mean, personally, I feel like they respected life. See how many different life forms they created? It's not their fault. They... No, da, 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 da. 
Flip unable to activate. Matter conduit energy shortage detected. Identifying cause. Cause identified. Unauthorized ciphering of energy by chemical creatures. Locations recombination labs in the biomass incubation complex. Time is short. Let's split up. Limit uh, culprits. I am prey dispatch creatures. Recombination labs. I shall so sweep the incubation complex. Take care of return. Hit that when you are done. So. Alphano, Yastola, and Astinian are gonna go do Sun while I get my own ass kicked by myself. That's fantastic. Yeah, at least I can fly. Hey, I guess there is a bonus here. Back fly. Oh, I do remember this area now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, friends. Yeah. I need to see you all die. Good. Ooh. That wasn't all of them? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, I remember this area and how much of a bitch it was when he had to do this originally. It sucks going through here at the same level as these things and they're all attacking you, it's a bitch. Oh, there it is. Eh, semi-lucky. Friends. That was it? I don't know what's that bad. I thought that was going to be more of a bitch. In terms of like enemy counts or something, I thought it was going to be a little bit more complex. I actually forgot about that. Hmm. Time to fly off into oblivion listening to the fanciful music of the Chopo. Ooh. We are. Guys, what up? Machines are not to be trusted, at least of all those that can think. Yeah, you got that wrong. Alpha knows come from Master Louise Wall would be proud. While facing the chimerical creatures and a moment of inspiration, I feel I have attained a better affinity with my arcane uh, entities. Good. Flip energy restore to the conduit. Please wait a moment while I activate it. Now as you guys can clearly hear, sinuses are acting up perfectly well. Just as I called. It's like I prophesized it. Fuck yeah, cat. Knew it would do it. Alright, let's sit there and get back on this bitch. So the Galleons managed to land. Repairs on a vessel appear to be well underway. 
I doubt they will be leaving anytime soon, but Renee, they will remain here long after they've stripped the Isle of all its secrets. Whether or not they mean to linger, their presence here and is not and now is an unwelcome complication. Indeed, let us avoid confrontations unless absolutely needful. I mean, what do you describe as needful? Ah, guiding node. Guidance of node is ready to take through the gamma quarters. Warning intruders detected and enforced in the quadrant. It is recommended that you avoid confrontation where possible. He kindly reminded that, in accordance with terms and conditions of use, you and your party assume all risk of damages or injuries, including death, that you may sustain in the course of guidance. Please follow me to the next matter. Uh, conduit it leads to the Delta Quadrant, where the facility's greatest achievement is located. That's great. Ah, uh, the ability to fly. Speaks of unders. See, the goal is to hover above the ground, but ever so lightly. Oh, you know what I keep thinking of? I really want to go play some freaking War Thunder. I don't think I can get my friends together. I got, I got a few friends that might be interested. The Fifth Legion has long been the favorite of the Emperor Varus. The Iron Fist, which uh, he crushes uprisings with. Soldiers bear the sigil of the Fifth Legion, ordinarily deployed with an insult bird. They are certainly a long way from him. Wait, something is afoot. Epicarian music. Our objective lies at the heart of the Isle. The third will remain to guard the ship, while the second patrols the perimeter and eliminates any threats. The first will come with me to secure the research facility. Let no man doubt the import of our mission. The Alagans found a means to capture icons alive, and their knowledge lies hid upon this isle. If we can but acquire it, we would be able to prevent the beings from returning to plague us, thus ending the cycle of rebirth. I need not remind you that success will raise our legion high in the Emperor's regard. Yet, by the same token, his radiance does not tolerate failure. That is all. All troops, prepare for deployment! So that is their purpose. To think that the knowledge used to bind no lesser being than Bahamut sleeps here. Imprisoning a primal in such a manner would represent an effective means to halt the cycle of summoning, were it not for the grave and obvious risks. Indeed. We need but refer to past experience, that of Bahamut's calamitous return, to see why this is not the solution we seek. Held in duress, a primal will continue to nurse its hatred for mankind. And when it inevitably breaks free, its rage will be beyond quelling. Ooh. Whatever folly the Garleans mean to commit, they can wait. 
We must remain focused on our task. Yes, of course. It would not be polite to keep the Archbishop waiting. Ah, things could never be that easy. Aha, winner. Oh, why sprint when you can just cheat and fly over things? I am a lazy bastard sometimes. That makes me happy. What's happening down here? Ah, but they just find this point to find some possibility, but it appears the danger is not yet past warning. Intruder is approaching. Please eliminate them if you wish. Okay. The last thing is, I don't care. Tog, I got you back. Yeah, when you're high level, you can do whatever the hell you please. Yeah, I don't care. Bye, friends. That guy's probably going, why the hell is this person here? Friend. would explain my men's silence. We meet again, and this time we will not be interrupted. No, we will not. Come, show me your power, champions of Eorzea. I know your friend put their weapons away. Like, you don't really think you're going to win a 1v4, right? <laughs> Your ass. I shall make it quick. Oh, he has that dumb ability. I really hate that ability, it's so annoying. It's not even dangerous, he's just like, he'll do these X attacks that like, just go forward randomly and attack different areas. Like, his ability to do it isn't, like, dangerous, it's real easy to dodge. But it's just the fact that it exists. I'm not down a lot of his health, so I'm doing pretty good. I don't know if there's any others here. I see his shoulders out of bounds. Okay, your one attack is going that way. I stand right about here, the same attack, and then go the same direction. And you know, if I walk over here, I got nothing to fear. Absolutely not to fear. Thing is, we've already cleared the objective. He's nearly dead. Sorry, friend, but you are now taken out. I had heard the tales of your strength, warrior of light, and now that I have experienced it firsthand, 
Van Balesar's defeat seems less inexplicable. You are a formidable foe, and I have thoroughly enjoyed our time together. Alas, all good things must come to an end. Alagan's secrets are waived, and there is no profit to be had in remaining here. Why they have a giant chicken ship? Keep them occupied. I sound like it took his helmet off. It would seem we have no choice. You must continue on. We will hold them here. Take the eye. It should still hold enough energy to be of use to you. I shall join you as soon as I am able. I just find it really funny he hands us the eye. You know, the same thing, it can be incredibly evil. Enough talk. Make haste and stop the Archbishop. Come on, brother, we gotta go. character doesn't want to leave our friends behind, but we must stop the Archbishop or continue fight against the Garlands. Welcome to the Delta Quadrant, where methods are developed for mastering dragons. To this day, the sector is home to live specimens brought over from the southern continent of Merceda. It's really a testament to the greatness of our elegant empire. Oh god. I regret to inform you that the matter conduit leading to the flagship is no longer functioning. Court of was destroyed by a dragon which broke free of its straits when they failed approximately 2,000. 369 years ago. One month, 24 days, 7 hours, and 4 minutes ago. Uh, please find an alternate route to the Ethrochemical Research Facility. The Allegan Research Council apologize for any inconvenience caused. So thy journey has led to you to the accursed plague. The Canthazal here at model, the ceaseless keening of my kindred, stepped in five thousand years of suffering. Long well, before the Ish Guardians and their base patrol, there was still more wicked men th whose ambitions knew no bounds. Fearful for our might and covetous of our power, they devised the means to enslave dragon kind. Their vile misdeeds and knots uh, did set in motion a train of events whose repercussions are felt to this day. Beyond that will find one of my first broad. Hark thou unto her words, partake thou of her pain, think thou upon the suffering that the conflict betwixt our kinds hath begot. We 
you know. The other thing is we're already here. We'll fly. This area is actually kind of neat. Ah, I see that that other he the healer mage person is actually with us too now. I am not running to an ounce of this place. I am freaking just flying. I do not believe it. Yeah. We're leaving laziness. God invented it for a reason. What a freaking dragon. A bitch, huge. How do I get up here? I always forget this thing's here. God. That's one of his first broad. Huh. Neat. A great worm is being held in some manner of restraint. Big ass dragon. Who cometh this forsaken place and disturbeth my solitude? What do you bitch? I never understand why they have your characters so confrontational all the time. Tiamat, Tiamat my child. Father, can it truly be None other. My form is such that I may travel with Heidelin's chosen. The mortal who desires to end the war between man and dragon. Millennia have passed since I was brought low by the men of Avog to think that war rages still between our kind. Hearken to my tale, child of man, I am Timiat of Mitzgozmir first blood and fraud. In a time before time, my father did come to the star bearing seven eggs. From these eggs did my children hatch, and once they were full grown, they took wing and spread across all the lands of Hydaelyn. <laughs> Together, my brood brother Bahamut, I journeyed south the Maricida, I guess you could say modern day Corthus, and together we brought forth innumerable children into this world. Ow. We abided in peace and all was well until the men of Allah came some 5,000 years since. They slaughtered my children in droves and took from me my beloved Muhammad. Twas then when I had fallen into the depths of the despair that black road men came unto me, the Asians. Again? They offered to resurrect Bahamut through their dark arts, and I, in my grief, accepted the decision which I still regret unto my dying breath. <laughs> 
But what they brought back was a mockery of my beloved. Whereas the Asians gifted his murder as a means to entrap him. Know this, child of man, the beings I call gods are but specters of thy mind's creation, given form at the great cost of two idols. Many such beings yet slumber across the land, brought to heal by the selfsame empire that bound me. They must not be released into the world. If thou wilt end the conflict, vanquish thee the Asians and deliver the weak of will from the bonds of their dark influence. Uh, it's been five thousand years, my child. Wilt thou not forgive thyself? No moon up on, no one ear on, no eight king. Mm, he's gush full and he left on. The release of death is denied me here, yet I desire not freedom. Nay, father, I shall live on my grid until the world itself has ceased to be. Mm, and scarf on us tie esk is ach such is my just punishment for consorting with darkness, for calling forth a lonesome and lamentable creature with blackened my blood, my beloved's memory. Oh. I'm back. The last crystal. The red one, since I write about red. Please go low, red. Fire. All six crystals are back, boys. Oh, hey. Warrior of Light, Beloved Daughter, The Light abideth within thy heart again. Full valiantly didst thou overcome thy many trials, but glory not in thy success. For the servants of darkness are ever close at hand. Receive of me my blessing once more. And go forth to shine thy light on all creation. Don't worry everybody, we're fine. Thou hast broken down the wall I built around thee, and partaken of thy mistress's blessing once more. I almost clipped. Strong art thou, mortal. Stronger than any other of thy kind. Having looked upon thy deeds, I am convinced. Thou art worthy to bear her light. The covenant bound me to thee, but would seem our fates were mingled from the first. Though I will not fight thy battles, I will yet lend thee my wings. We go 
to cast out the darkness. I have a flying mid goat there now. Whee. You can now ride mid goats there. Feeling like you're taken out of context. Just me? Just me. Whoa. Funny thing is, they actually don't point you to this direction. If you are not careful, um, yeah, you might have an issue with this. I'm just saying. We have the black chocobo. Such our mounts again. We've been we've been riding the black chocobo for so long. The Godzmia will now be our new flying companion. I love dragons. Guys, notice waited your arrival at the flagship with customary patience. Long to flash the flagship, Mr. Zed, you are almost at your destination. Warning intruders de uh, detected in the vicinity. Please eliminate them if you wish to proceed. Ah, another set of intruders to kill. I love games. Then I think once we get to the... Actually, when we get to the location of the... Dungeon, which is right up here, that's when I'll end the episode. As of now, I'm not ending it. What about other players here already? Quite curious. Wow, he's not. Who the hell is he? Oh, warning intruders approaching. What intruders? Why are you idiots here? Please. Another set. Your armor sucks. Leap area secure, lifting access restriction to the Ethereochemical Research Facility. Restriction lifted, you may have to leisure ending guidance. Aw, oh, Gilly. Unknown energy source detected within the Ethereochemical Research Facility. Please exercise caution. Please, that has been of service to you, Mr. Said. Please send my regards to Master Witch. Activating. Loop. And it's gone. Aw. Oh. it's gone. Guys, there to cease the function. Oh, now I have crippling de depression. Uh. Ah, the dungeon. Okay. Well, unfortunately, I actually have to end the episode right here, guys. Um. Yeah, we're we're ending it on a high note. Like this high note. And we're gonna be facing up. Looks cooler this way. Well, unfortunately guys, as I sit there and say, we have to unfortunately end an episode as always. I think we started the episode around 05. It was that minute I'd say about a minute where I wasn't recording, so we're at forty three. I think this is well over thirty minutes. Yeah, I put an estimate on that. So the interesting thing is, I is again, I love the story in this. The Alligans use this facility to entrap and perform immediate tests on different species, creating hybrids and such for their scientific endeavors. Unfortunately, the dragons were considered part of these scientific endeavors. Midgothmir was probably considered an enemy to them, along with any of his brood. Unfortunately, um, they got captured nonetheless, as powerful as they are. And there was nothing they could freaking do. Um, and as we sit there and see, one of them was still captured, one of his daughters. And she chooses to remain here because of her own problems with accepting the Asians' help and having Muhammad 
memory, which it sounds like, from what it sounds like, Bahamut was actually a really nice dragon. He might have been probably close to race vulgar almost, and sort of in a way, like very nice, peaceful, one to stay secluded, but probably willing to be friendly towards different species. But the Allegans were somebody who wanted, to, or a group that wanted to test stuff on people. And in terms of that, they wanted to test all their stuff on dragons, which pissed the dragons off. They captured them, they killed them. Pretty much everything you don't want them to do to your freaking kids. So, the Hamid and the other dragon were very pissed. Probably got into a fight. One got captured, one got killed. The one in its grave got the assets to bring it back. Not realizing that it was not going to be the same thing. But, um, before I continue on in my rabble. Uh, we will come back to this, ladies and gents. We'll head into the Ethereal Chemical Research Facility here on Ozzy's Law in the flagship. Uh, so with that, unfortunately, we'll be ending it. So please like, subscribe, leave a comment down below when we come back, ladies and gents. More Final Fantasy XIV, and we'll be heading into the dungeon then. See you then. Thanks.